So the premise is simple. You get a mandrill, pair him with the balloon from the ferret, and keep spamming the feints in battle and keep buffing up your guys. As soon as you get him to level three, you're probably gonna be around tier six. So then you can get the mongoose, and then you start dealing some actual scaling, which is going absolutely insane. Definitely worth trying out. I really enjoy the TV. The other two mongoose toys don't work with the mandrill, unfortunately, because they aren't activated on break. They just start a battle. TV is the only option for the mandrill. Nonetheless, it's a fun one. I'd recommend trying it out. Let me know if it works for you. Hope you enjoy. Start me with a couple homies here. Okay. Um, actually, probably should have ran Chipmunk there, I think. Actually, I, if I didn't run Chipmunk there, I should have not frozen it. <laughs> I just did exactly what I shouldn't do, but I knew I was going to get a second chipmunk, of course. So there's no reason not to, right? Alright, cool. So we get two levels next turn. Love to see it. This guy's running stork nonsense. You hate to see it. Alright, we get a good lineup here with the level up, so we'll take it. Um, combine, combine. Okay. Um, you know what? Let's try it. And then we try to find a chipmunk, get the level two flying squirrel, so we can ditch the, the homie, the ferret up top. Oh, that's a pretty strong combo you got there. Kind of. <laughs> Eight attack really doesn't do a whole lot for you, I guess. Um, sure. For sure. Yeah, I mean, even if we get it, we'd have to sell a lot to get the flying squirrel level up. Maybe we don't. Um, yeah, let's, let's roll. Let's see what we find here. That's tempting. Definitely is. Um, no, I think we're good. We could have gotten that level 3 Marmoset. Isn't that crazy? Ooh, okay. Fantastic, we take those. You know, if you think about it, hold on, I have an idea. Eagle, maybe. I think Saiga Antelope is just better. Probably. If we can find another ferret and a squirrel, I have a great idea. <laughs> um, do we care about Chipmunk? What if we don't? What if we just don't for a second? I, I think this will be more fun. We're gonna get some weird toy shenanigans cooking here. Okay. Ooh, the eucalyptus gets him there. Okay. Hey, it's strong. I'll give it to you. It's pretty strong. There it is. Level you. Falcon seems kind of good. I need to get a ferret though. We need to get one more ferret and then we're cooking. Okay, throw you on here. Oh, this is just not lining up great, is it? <laughs> not at all. He's also got the stork. Stork OP. Double Falcon. Alright, what do we get here? Husky, we could we could work with. I think we probably get rid of you. Just stack a couple homies. We need to find this ferret. We're so ready for the ferret now, and we just can't find anything. We got a huge homie up front, so that's good.
<laughs> this doesn't seem like it's gonna end well. Oh, okay, hold on. We actually managed to get a draw there somehow. That's actually insane. Roll me. I mean, it's not gonna be a level 3 flying squirrel angle. I'll tell you that right now. As much as you want to play it up like it is, it ain't. Could just go banana. Banana pill on someone. I mean, I'll hold it. This is insane. Absolute insanity right here. Hmm, not very nice. <laughs> it's so funny to me when the hawks just go back and forth. Just trading. Some weird proxy war they got going on here. Dude, all I want is a ferret. Is that too much to ask? Apparently it is. And at this point, we just need to get the mandrill to level 3 and then pull send a mongoose. Like, that's way less fun. <laughs> oh man, at least the husky and balloon, I guess, to some extent are scaling us. There he is. Okay. Now we can get rid of you. Panther's not gonna work great with the husky. Maybe we just banana pill you. Okay, and then, I mean, do we do? It, it can't be the right play, right? Surely it's not. It just feels like this weekly has so few scaling options that it's just like, it's just good enough, you know? Anything you get is just good enough. It's kind of a nice feeling. It's liberating to some degree. Roll me, what do we get? Tiger? No. I wonder if Tiger would work with the Mandrill. Like, would Flying Squirrel bring it back out in time for two triggers? I don't think I'm invested enough to, to find out. <laughs> but I am curious if anyone knows the answer. Um, Conpeto? Probably not. Cool. Just in time, we get the mongoose with the mandrill set up. So we'll get rid of the monkey here. Okay, I see you. Hey, you it it's within your right to run it. I ain't gonna hate. Maybe a little bit. <laughs> we go here. We go here. And then we go mongoose. Probably television, right? Could run a peanut jar too. If we run peanut jar. No, that doesn't work because it's not on break. Television's the only one that of these three that work with the mandrill. That makes our, our job pretty easy. Makes our decision easy, I guess. Cool. I'm telling you, it's a tatsel worm weekly. Every single time. But, we, you know, we're almost getting there. I think it's got potential. We just gotta give it another shot, you know? We're almost there. Alrighty, give me a ferret. Give me another ferret. Could be a little ambitious. That's too much. <laughs> it's a little too much. I not like this. We will freeze you, though. Peculiar fossils. We'll put it that way. Yeah. 
Okay, so we just gotta make sure we don't lose the next one. This is a little too much. Okay, tell you what, we do this. We go puffin. Freeze you two. Hope this is good enough. That's our plan. <laughs> our plan is to hope. And it is. It's actually good enough to draw. <laughs> How insane is that? We go here. Just throw in whoever it gives us. We want to keep our balloon. Give you a strawberry. Big snipes. Big snipes. Somehow we're getting it done. I don't know. This is the power of the, the big ferret play. And Mandrill obviously works very well here. Actually run it like this. Sure. We can look for a level up. Don't mind. Don't mind if I do. Hmm. The the math wasn't working for us there. That's fine. Level you, get a tier four. What do we want here? Tatsal worm, probably. Just keep stacking the strawberries, I guess. That's our current plan. We get a level three ferret next turn. I think we just full send the level three. Oh, well, maybe not though. Right, because if you full send level three, then you're done. You can't get any more balloons. So maybe we do just kind of kind of chill it out, you know? So many of them, it's insane. Um, we're just rolling here, looking for more Atlantic puffins, if possible. There's no shot we get flying, so we're level three, right? Maybe though. What if we try? We could also just hold off on it too if we need to. Beautiful. Like we don't have to play the, the ferret right now. Um, or next turn I should say. I mean it's possible if we get really lucky, we could get the flying squirrel level 3. He knows how to play the game. Close. The fact that we were even close on the flying squirrel is just insane, by the way. Not flying squirrel, the level 3 stork. So we take those. Here are the tatsal worm. We go whale. Whale eats you. It's actually not good. Hold on. <laughs> we need to rethink this one. Level you. Rhino, huh? Maybe rhino's the play instead of the whale. Back a rhino up front. Or a rhino behind the mandrill, maybe? Let's try this. Looking pretty good. Beautiful. Rhino's doing work. Love to see it. Um, I... Th hmm, it's tough, right? I'd love to get the flying squirrel cooking. So we can get permanent ferret synergy. Hey, what? Mosasaurus is the play here. I do believe that's the case. Yeah, okay, this looks good.
That's a little strange. I mean, I guess it worked for him. Well, the chili worked for him, I guess. The rest of it didn't. Alright. I think we gotta send it. Grab the balloon level 3. And then we can ditch the ferret. Throw in, what, Cerberus? Maybe a Wildebeest? We don't have any trumpets, though. Hold on to the Cerberus here. Um, Cerberus just doesn't really work with the Mosasaurus, right? That's so not a great combo. We could Husky. That also doesn't work with it, though. Hmm. I'd really like the Mosasaurus here. Don't think it's worth selling the ferret just yet. So let's wait one turn. And then we're gonna full send it. Oh, he's got the play. His play didn't work. <laughs> he had it a little bit off. Alright, now we're gonna do it. So we go here. Sell you. So now we're just gonna stay. We're fine with the level two, but balloons, it really doesn't matter that much. Let's go here, here, here. Mongoose isn't gonna work. We need the mandrill to be level three for that. Um, and then this. This would be fine, but we already have the guys we need. Okay, do we have mushroom? We do have mushroom. So let's try to get the mandrill mushroomed. We gotta use our chocolate to get the mushroom though. That's fine. Not a problem. Keep it coming. We can do this all day, brother. <laughs> all day. That's what the Cerberus is here for. Okay. So now I say we do this. Still don't want that one. We're looking for mushrooms now. That's our big power spike. We got the, the Mosasaurus set up for it. This guy is huge. Gotta be careful of this, homie. Ooh, we were kind of close. We were getting there. Alright, give me a mushroom. Come on, you know you want to. There it is. That's huge. That is absolutely huge. Now, can we get the rhino, perhaps? A little greedy, but I'd like it. No, we cannot. Okay. I mean, this is totally fun. As long as we don't die here, that'd be a little unfortunate. Oh, we're definitely gonna die here. Oh, we're actually good. Hold on. Dude, the panther chili is so terrifying. If it hits just right, it's menacing. <laughs> It'll take you out so easy. So I'm glad it's not hitting just right. We're getting pretty fortunate with it, all things considered. Um, I guess Rhino would be the next step. That's great. Yeah, I think we go for Rhino here. I think we're good here. I guess it's a question of can we take out this dog? Which, yes, we definitely can because we got this ginormous Cerberus out here. Okay, we go here. Um, Mandrill's not going to help us. We're looking for a Rhino. Um, if it was a tier 6, we could level and try to find it there. But this is fine. This will do. So at this point, who can we get rid of? Nobody? Cool. <laughs> that just kind of is what it is. So really, I guess we should be putting Potato on you. Because you're our primary scaling homie. The scaling engine we, we need. Let's 
peanuts. Peanuts will get you. Maybe there's a an ordering we could have done to deal with it better, but I mean peanuts are peanuts, right? They're they're gonna kill you. That's just it is what it is. But I mean the toy builds are kind of fun. Mosasaurus, I think, is what makes it. But I like that you can carry this love the tier one toy into Ultra Late Game and it actually does work. It's fun. I like it. Hold on to the ferret. I don't think we need a hummingbird. Some peculiar streamers. Even though we aren't streaming. Sure, we'll take the draw. Alright, throw you in the mix. Scoop up another tennis ball. Mouse into another mouse. We can greet a little bit now. Every time it hits that guy. I don't know what it is. Seems like the geckos are a tennis ball magnet. Alright, we found a mandrill. Come on. There he is. Balloon me, and then... Maybe we go for a hair? Maybe? I think this is good. This is like a solid team right here. The hair is just kind of weird because it, it'll sometimes steal coconut, but it also sometimes just doesn't do anything. <laughs> so it's like... I don't know. Would you rather go somebody that you know is going to do stuff? Maybe. Definitely not out of the conversation, per se. Okay, let's get rid of you. Go mandrill here. We could also do two mandrills if we can get a flying squirrel. Like, that's totally in the realm of plausibility here. Good, looking fantastic. We need to get a level 2 flying squirrel is the issue. And that can be kind of dicey in my experience. Balloon me. We go baboon here. Okay, we can get a level up next turn. Looking for a... What are we looking for? Flying Squirrel for sure. I think that actually worked out better for us, that he stole the coconut. There's the Flying Squirrel. Tell you what, combine... There to you. Flying Squirrel is good in battle. Good, we can refresh here. That's huge. We need to get Flying Squirrel level 2, like, ASAP. Otherwise, we're going to be in trouble. <laughs> Such a weird little graphics glitch on this thing. And now we have two. Two chests overlapped. Okay, cube another big boy. We got another level two balloon. We really gotta find the flying squirrels here. Otherwise we are in deep trouble. We could also combine here. Do we have any tier fives? Get like a husky. Mosasaurus too would be really good. Let's try it. Cube is okay. Not super exciting, but it's okay. Um, okay, Flying Squirrel, great. Uh, we do need to find a second one next turn. 
that we could like make that one happen. That'd be pretty cool. Okay. Down to four hearts. I can't believe we haven't lost any hearts yet. That's incredible. Let's see if we can get the flying squirrel. We do not. I think I'll save the tree here. We might just end up ditching the ferret. So we'll level up the tree. If we get a mongoose, I think we ditch the ferret, stick with the level one flying squirrel, and just try to get the mandrill to level three. That's going to be the plan. Whether it works, <laughs> I guess we'll find out. But that's the current plan here. Level you. We did not find it, so I guess we're going to keep climbing up. That's huge. Oh boy, okay. Another opportunity here. I mean, the, the, the shoe bill has done nothing for us. <laughs> the, the husky in a vacuum would be better. Um, but we might also just replace it with something else entirely. Not sure yet. Looking good. Oh, dude, that chili. Why is chili so strong? Anyone know? Anyone figured out the secrets? If you have, let me know. <laughs> Roll me. I guess we're going huskies. We're not in a rush to level the flying squirrel anymore. Since we already lost the ferret toy. Yeah, nice try, bucko. Alright, give me a level. There it is. We go mongoose. Television. Because the mandrel will break it, flying swirl brings it back. Um, we could competo our tree <laughs> if we want something here. There's a few decent options. Is that worth it though? I kind of just like the coconut right now. We can do that later. Dang, we didn't find any mongoose. Five tier fives, and we found two duplicates. No mongoose. Feels bad, man. Okay, that's fine. We're just starting to scale up here. What do we got? Get you primed. Give you a mushroom, because you're good with mushrooms. Alright, let's see how this goes. Oh, baby, that mushroom saved us right there. That's huge. Alright. Now, can we get the mongoose level? That's the question now. Let me... Because you're going to be too big now, so let's do this. You're going to spawn it as a level 3. That's not actually good. Or level two, sorry. Puma's pretty good here. Maybe we just ditch you, right? Puma's just better. There it is. Okay, so next turn we'll get the mongoose toy. I think we will overwrite television because it's so much more scaling. Um, even Tiger in place of the, the Husky could be good. I guess that's... The Husky is permanent scaling. Tiger would be temporary. Aside from the every now and then ability. Okay, can we get through these guys? Yes, we can. That's huge. Okay. 
we're coming out on the other end. I love it. I mean, I, yeah, so I think we do override it. I know we're close, but it's just a little risky not to. So you're giving 2-2. Two, two. We go Tiger behind the Puma. That would give 2-2 two, two temporarily. But it would give it to everybody. Hold on to him. We could also on Peto the Husky and try to get what? <laughs> There's a lot of misses. I don't think that's going to be worth it. Let's just roll, see what else we can find here. You just throw in a sushi, I guess. Just for fun. All right, what do we got here? A lot of coconuts. We have a lot of damage though. And it gets us there. Holy moly. Scaling OP. All right. So I think we're just rolling here. Maybe we ditch the Husky now. If we find a Konpeto, I'll try to Konpeto the Husky. We get two efforts. That's great. That's even better than we thought than we would have had with the tiger. Okay, huge. Huge. Alright. And let's just see if we get there. This would be awesome. That's fine. Giving 6-6 six, six to everybody every time. Dude. Alright, alright. <laughs> Would have actually been better to beat him because he would have been able to get a level 3 sloth there. Um, roll me. Looking for another Puma. There's one. We could also come pay to the mongoose here. See if we get something good. Nope. <laughs> we did not. Let's see if this is enough. I don't know. We got peanuts. That's a little scary. We do have a lot of stats. It's, it feels like we're close, you know? Like, we have the setup. It's just not scaling qu quicker. Or it can't really deal with peanuts either. But it's not scaling quicker than some of the other options. I don't know. Let me know if you guys can get this to work. I keep seeming to die at like eight and nine wins every single time. Like it's good. It's just not good enough. I don't know. Maybe that's just in my experience, but let me know if it works for you guys. It's a fun build regardless. It's been a lot of fun. Hope you enjoyed.